we're having tea and um, Andrew is talking about Fergie, which is his ex-wife at that point, and Ghislaine's bad-mouthing Fergie as well, and Epstein's just socially awkward, so I think he's just laughing about everything. On that particular day that, that, that um, uh, we now understand is the date, which is the 10th of March, uh, I was at home. Uh, I was with the children. I'd taken Beatrice to uh, a Pizza Express in Woking for a party at, a, I suppose, sort of four or five in the afternoon. We went into the VIP section. There was no waiting in the lines, obviously, you were with a prince. Um, Andrew asked me what I wanted to drink, you know, and I said, you know, something from the bar. He had something clear. I know mine was vodka. Uh, I'm almost, in fact, I'm convinced um, that I was never in tramps with her. There are a number of things that are wrong with that story. One of which is that, is that I don't know where the bar is in, in um, tramps. Um, uh, I don't drink. Um, I don't think I've ever bought a drink in Tramp uh, whenever I was there. So Andrew drives in the other car. He's not with us. He's with his security guards. And in the car, Ghislaine tells me that I have to do for Andrew what I do for Jeffrey. And that made me sick. I just didn't expect it from royalty. Well, there was a bath and it started there and then it led into the bedroom and it didn't last very long, the whole entire procedure. It was disgusting. He wasn't mean or anything, but he got up and he said thanks and walked out and I sat there in bed just horrified and ashamed and felt dirty and I had to get up and go have a shower and it was a wicked time in my life. It was a really scary time in my life. I, I can absolutely categorically tell you it never happened. Do you recall any kind of sexual contact with Virginia Roberts none, then or none, any other time? None whatsoever.